the New Tab Drawing File tab has been renamed to Start and remains persistent as you create and open additional drawings. You can press Control Home or use the new Go to Start command to switch focus from the current drawing to the Start tab. The new Close All Other command offers command line access to close all the open drawings except the current one. On the Learn page, the tip of the day is updated every 24 hours and you can use the arrows to cycle through multiple tips one at a time. And tips can now contain inline images. The new tab mode system variable has been renamed to start mode. When set to zero, the start tab is not displayed. If you set it back to one, the start tab is displayed the next time you launch AutoCAD. A new deployment option enables you to control whether the start tab is displayed for install deployments. Layouts now support drag and drop to move or copy layouts to positions that are hidden in the overflow menu. As you drag the selected layouts to the right or left edge of the layout tabs, they automatically scroll, enabling you to drop the layouts into the proper position. New controls in the Layout right-click menu enable you to dock the Layout tabs above the status bar or in line with it. Isolate Objects and Lock UI have been added to the status bar customization menu. The Lock User Interface tool on the status bar enables you to check and uncheck multiple UI options one at a time instead of having to reopen the flyout each time. Click the icon to enable or disable UI locking. The status bar can now automatically wrap onto two rows when there are more icons than what fit into a single row. At any given time, the model tab and at least one layout tab is always displayed. The new Gallery View system variable enables you to control whether ribbon galleries are displayed. When Gallery View is set to 1, thumbnail preview images of blocks, as well as dimensions, M leaders, and table styles, display in the ribbon. When it's set to zero, the insert dialog box is displayed to access blocks, and traditional style lists are displayed in the ribbon to access dimension, M leader, and table styles. Improvements to the AutoCAD help system make it easier to access relevant help content and tools. When you sign into your A360 account from AutoCAD, you are automatically signed into help documentation and vice versa. Signing into help documentation enables you to like a help topic to easily refer back to it in the future. When you click on the Find link for a tool in the Help window, an animated arrow points to the location of that tool in the Quick Access Toolbar or Ribbon. In AutoCAD 2016, this functionality has been extended to include the Application menu and Status Bar. If an icon is available in the Status Bar but not currently visible, the UI Finder will point to the Customization status bar icon.